Don't forget to like and subscribe to Evolve MAP. Hello, this is Amber Zinke with Evolve Logical. Today we're going to be talking about parameter sync and some of the rules that we ship with, more specifically the hanger catalog rule. So first I'm going to go into my parameter sync and you're going to see we have all of this information right within here. So we have our rule name, our element filter, all that good stuff. But I'm actually going to come up here and go into import rules and you're going to find your folder that has the pre-shipped rules from Evolve. And you're going to see we have a good amount of them that we ship with for you to be able to use. But today I'm going to be focusing on the hanger catalog. So to import this in, I'm just going to select it and hit open. And now it's going to bring it into my parameter sync rules. So you're going to see I have my rule name being hanger catalog. I have my element filter. I'm going to come into this and you're going to see my rules defined for my element filter here. I have my copy from parameters. And then I have my description. So this rule will generate a catalog number based on the trapeze configuration. And then we have a PowerShell script for you as well. So you can see it has it all figured out for you, which is again, really nice that we do ship with these rules preset for you. And then our copy to parameter is the evolved description. So I'm gonna press okay. And I'm gonna show you how this works when this is enabled and when it's not enabled. So first I'm going to place in some hangers here. I'm not going to worry about my profile. I'm just going to say down the entire path, choose the direction and place some hangers in here. So you're going to see when I have these hangers placed and when I go into my description here, so I'll select on this hanger here and I'll go into my properties. You're going to see my evolved description is my two tier trapeze with hardware. And this one is my one tier trapeze with hardware. So that is without my parameter sync rule being turned on. That's just the default description generated. But now I'm going to come back into my parameter sync and say enable. I'm going to hit apply and I'm going to come up here and I'm going to refresh. So I'm going to select on my rule here and I'm going to say refresh the full project. You can also refresh your current view, but I'm just going to do my full project. So you can see all of my elements are being processed. And from there, now I'm gonna press okay and I'm gonna select on the same hanger here. And you see when I scroll down in my properties and I go to my evolved description, you're gonna see it now my evolved description is its hanger catalog. So now I'm gonna select on my single tier and you're gonna see that my evolved description has changed within here as well. So this is being able to refresh your project. Now all of those evolved descriptions for your hangers will reflect that parameter sync rule. Now we're going to be talking about the information that is produced within your vault description. You can see my numbers are not rounded within here. So if you do want rounded numbers, we'll go into our edit type here and we'll go into our rod length rounding. And I'm just going to do a one foot rounding. This can be whatever you are needing for the accuracy level of your rounding. I'm just going to do one foot. So I'm press OK. And now I'm going to rerun that parameter sync rule and refresh it. So I'm going to say, this is the one I need. I'm going to refresh my full project. It's going to do my processing of my elements and I'm going to press OK. And now when I select on that, now my information will be rounded. So again, let's talk about the information that is shown here. So it is a two tier back to back. It is 26 inches and the rod lengths are 60 inches for both rods. So again, the parameter sync rule is auto generating this description for you based on the configuration of your hanger itself. So if it is different, that description will change for you all automatically. So that is today's fun feature Friday on the parameter sync rule hanger catalog. If you have any questions or want to see more, please visit our website and request a demo. Thank you.